What is going on guys? My name is Alex. Welcome back to a brand new video. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys exactly how to use Wondershare or VidAir because they actually approached to me and it actually looks really, really nice. I would love to give this a shot and introduce to you guys this really, really nice in-browser editor, how you can edit like templates for intros, outros, all kinds of categories. So if you guys are excited for this video, make sure to smash the like button down below, subscribe if you're here for the very first time watching. And I would say, let's Let's get started with this video right after the intro. So right here, as you can see, this is the official website, an online video solution to help your business soar, expand your market with video. And then it says start from scratch or choose a template. Now, if you're going to click on choose from a template right here, we have a lot of choices when it comes to what do we actually want to edit? Is it an edit for yeah, like a YouTube video, an intro, an outro or something else like a cart or even like some sort of a presentation for any kind of job appliance or even for school, anything that you guys can imagine, you can find it right here. So right here you want to choose your categories i just clicked on intro and outro and if we click on for example travel right here you can notice that we have a lot of different ones that we can choose from this is of course like the instagram story you know resolutions so you can all customize them so let's go ahead and say that we're going to edit from a template first before we're going to start from scratch let's just browse the catalog and the options that we have all right guys so as you can see right here it says school model a video template perfect for promoting educational organizations such as schools universities universities and more which basically shows you this clip where you can have also in different resolutions so if I click on this vertical one 9 by 16 that could be really really nice for Instagram but I'm going to pick the white which is going to be the 16 by 9 which is then automatically going to adjust it as you can see right here so then I'm going to click on use this template and it's really cool that you can use this on multiple different platforms so let's say that you want to use this one for YouTube you can pick the 16 by 9 but if you also want to have it in the same theme on Instagram you can just pick the 9 by 16 and also the four by three for the regular Instagram post. So right here, if you click on next, this is basically a little tutorial, customize elements in the toolbar. If you click on next, we have click here to generate your video file. We have an export button. So we're gonna click on, I got it. And as you can see, everything is completely customizable from the text. So right here, as you notice, we have all kinds of logo options that we can upload. We have the default text. We have also the part underneath it. Of course, the video itself that we can replace if you want to. So let's go back to the first scene and then we can type in for example let's say that we're going to pick 2021 and then underneath it we're going to pick school year and then we're going to click on okay so if i play this back this is what it looks like This one is really short. This is just the first slide of the first scene. So we're gonna click on the next one. And then right here it says be motivated. And then on the third scene it says be driven. So now we can also, for example, swap the backgrounds. So if I click on here, it says video. And then you can also click on add to add something else on it if you want to. But if you want to adjust, but if you want to change an existing slide, you just click on here and then it says trim video, crop video, add a clip, duplicate, replace, or delete. So if you're gonna click on delete, that's gonna also delete that entire scene. But if you would just want to replace something, for example, the clip itself, right here, you wanna click on replace. And then of course you can choose a different scene. Let's say we're gonna pick this one. Then we're gonna click on replace. And as you notice, if I play this back, it looks really, really nice. And now the scene is replaced with something else. And that's very, very cool. Everything is completely customizable, guys. You don't have to worry about a single thing being locked into the project that you cannot change whenever it's for example even the background color of the word driven right here as you see it says color so if you click on this guy if i drag this one to for example the pink side you can even customize every little detail that you see right here so now that we have done this let's go and start from scratch as well so now if I click on here, start from scratch, it's actually cool to also choose your resolution. Do you want to use 16 by nine, nine by 16. So let's go ahead and pick also 16 by nine right here. Then it's going to open up, of course, our editor. All right, guys. So this is, of course, the same editor that you guys have seen a minute ago when we were working out of a template. So right here, what we need to do is we need to start editing from scratch because we're going to start off with a black screen. So now it actually depends on what do you want to promote? What do you want to show? So let's go and pretend 
that we're gonna actually promote the album that I've been working on for the past year and a half, which is almost done, guys, don't worry. But right here, it is actually more in the space vibe. So let's go ahead and click on this one. And now it's gonna add in this really nice space theme if I play it back, as you see, with the really cool lens flare. So now, if that, now that we've done that, we can also add in some text. So right here, it says text at the top. And then I'm going to pick the default text, or you can even choose the dynamic one, which is gonna also appear. I'm gonna delete all the text that you guys see right here. And I'm just going to only add in 2021 because that's the year of the release, of course. And then it is really, really cool that we can also make this one a lot bigger. We can totally customize this one how we want it. So let's play it back because it doesn't have to start with a black scene, but just with this one. But of course, guys, we actually need to add in a little bit more space because otherwise the line will not be visible. So let's do it like this. Boom. And then what we can actually do is we can add in another scene so you can look for the category. So let's say that I'm going to type in a space and right here it says outer space. It's gonna add in this nice galaxy, for example. I'm gonna click on here and then as you notice, this is what it looks like. Now we can also go ahead and add in some more different text. For example, this one, let's add that in. And then you can also customize it if you type in, for example, debut album like that. Now we can also click on OK. And if I play it back, this is what it looks like. As you notice, it's a really, really small and the basic trailer, of course, but this is basically how to get started. You can make this as, you know, as advanced as you like. If you want to add in, for example, like the custom videos, and of course, you don't have to always use the regular stock clips. So right here, I'm going to click on a video. And then right here, we also have our own upload button. So if you shot, for example, something outside, you don't necessarily have to use all the clips that are in here, of course, from one to share themselves. You can shoot stuff on your phone on your camera and then you can add that in it's really really nice so these are basically the basics and how to use these template guys if you want to keep everything in the same kind of category make sure to always use also the instagram template the 9 by 16 the 4 by 3 the instagram post as well and youtube video just to make sure to create like a whole world around it you know that everything stays of course in the same category the same style and that is basically how to do it this is how to use the wonder share of vid error video guys thanks a lot for watching Thanks a lot also for Wondershare for sponsoring this video. If you guys would like to see more product reviews on Wondershare stuff, make sure to let me know down in the comments which software and I'll see what I can do. Thanks a lot, guys. And I'll see you guys, obviously, in the next video.